Today's video is on the Sony LCS EJC3 case. It's um, a leather look case on the sides and bottom, but the top is a fabric plastic type look. The camera case is for the Sony NEX cameras and it fits the 18 to 55 standard lens. It also fits any lens smaller than that one. Um, if you have the pancake lens, it will still fit that. So don't go any bigger than the standard lens. Uh, the camera case only comes in black because every other colour has been discontinued. So um, I think the only place which sells the pink and the white is on eBay. Someone from Japan selling that, so you can Google that if you like. Um, I think the case is around £40 and I'm just going to show you a 360 of the case or all the way around anyway um, just because the light's slightly dodgy but so when you open the case it lifts all the way up here and also it lifts slightly up, so that's when it's down and it goes up just a little bit. Um, so in here, probably won't be able to see, but there is um, a lot of padding and a rest for the actual lens to go in. Uh, there's also a slight indent here for the actual grip section where the, um, the button is to take pictures. So if you have the NEX then that's got quite a large um, area there so that will fit in perfectly um, just the label the back which you can't take out but you won't notice that uh, at the top you have a lens cap holder which is really good because this case is more for the type of person on the go so you can just take the cap off put it in the spare SD card um, so that's all good. Also they have put two clips so if your case is kind of getting a bit fat from the amount of stuff you've got in there you can use this, uh, the larger one or if you want everything to be nice and tightly compact you can use a smaller one. Uh, the case is quite hard to close if the camera isn't in there as you can see. There we go. But when the camera is in there, you're pressing on an actual surface. So the case is really nice. And also it has this really cool strap at the side. So uh, you get your neck strap and you put the strap around here. And then you close the clip. And the clip's really strong, so it's unlikely to come off. So you have the strap coming out of here when it's in the camera. You loop it through here and then when you take the camera out of the case it's still connected by this hoop so it kind of goes to the end of your neck strap out of the way with your SD card and lens cap in so you can just drop it as long as you've got your neck strap on and it's just out of the way so I really like that living in England it rains a lot so I hate getting my camera wet because it's not waterproof. So put it in this case, protects it from the rain because it's this um, kind of hard plastic. So if you drop it, protected. Um, obviously I can't really say that it will protect it 100%, but it will definitely protect it more than not having the case on it. Um, you have to check online for some people dropping a camera off of a building with it because I'm not really sure on what this case can protect but definitely scratches, dust, um, slight knocks and drops definitely will protect it. really recommend this case. Sadly I can't show you my camera in it because I'm recording with it but um, yeah I really would recommend this case to everyone. Um, so I think that's it. So if you have any questions comment below. So thank you guys for watching and please subscribe and you're more than welcome to inbox me.